Hey, how's it going, everybody? Scott Sprintzer here, DocSports.com. Welcome to the update for Monday, March 22nd, 2021. Free pick coming up in college basketball, big dance action for Monday. That'll be in just a second. First, a couple of quick notes. If you've yet to become a member over at DocSports.com and just want to give it a trial run, click on that link below the video. Uh, get yourself set up for a free $60 account, which you can then use on any of my daily packages or anybody else on the roster at DocSports.com. And again, it all starts by clicking on the link below the video. If you were with me this weekend with premium plays, we went 10 and three all sports combined. So real nice weekend. Uh, we cashed in college basketball on Sunday, six star winner in NASCAR with Truex over Elliott, swept the weekend in soccer right down the line. Uh, just had a tremendous weekend overall going again, 10 and three in all sports. And we are also 71% in college basketball since the tourneys began on Wednesday, right through Sunday, 71% winners after cashing yesterday. And uh, we do have a play on Monday's card. It is a six-star play. 1-0 so far uh, in the big dance with my six-star plays. We won with Arkansas over Colgate just a few days ago. A six-star play. So it's available on my homepage at DocSports.com on Monday. Be sure to check that out. Uh, we've also got NBA. We went 2-1 and one yesterday in the NBA. 3-1 and one for the weekend. In fact, swept with five-star plays yesterday. It was the Cleveland Cavaliers. And I've got a five-star play again on Monday in the NBA. It's part of a two-game package. And one of them now that going back to before the All-Star break, we are now on a 68% NBA run, uh, picking up over $2,100 for $100 per unit betters. By the way, back to college basketball for a minute, 71% in the tourney since Wednesday, $5,780 with our college basketball sides run going way back several months now. And uh, so we look to keep that going on Monday. Again in the NBA, 68% run that began before the break. Uh, NHL, we passed yesterday, but we're up over $3,100 the last three weeks. Got a four-star play on Monday's card. Going to pass in soccer on Monday. 5-0 the last five soccer cards, and we're up almost $5,000 going back to February 1st, but we're going to go ahead and pass in soccer on Monday. And you know about uh, NASCAR, if you follow that, we hit with Truex, six-star play over Elliott uh, in NASCAR on Sunday. So... Real nice run everywhere. Uh, check out the college basketball six-star on Monday and also the uh, two-play report of the NBA led by that five-star play. We'll look to stay red hot. Let's talk a little bit of college basketball big dance action on Monday. Uh, we're looking at the battle between the Maryland Terrapins and the Alabama Crimson Tide. I think this line is fair if you like Alabama, and we do in this particular matchup. Uh, the problem with Maryland for me, listen, they did a good job getting past UConn, but UConn, uh, that offense hasn't looked too, too good in their last couple of games. They got shut down by Creighton got shut down uh, by Maryland in opening round play. But if you look at their last 16 games, talking about Maryland, where they're nine and seven straight up, you know, three of those wins came against Minnesota once and Nebraska twice, not to mention UConn's offense, which proved to be faltering the last couple of games. Uh, so it's not exactly like they've gone out and beaten the best of the best thus far to get where they are over the last oh, month or so of college basketball. Now they're going to take on an Alabama team that I think is just going to be too tough for them. Alabama's not going to give up second chances, third chances when you miss your opportunities on the offensive end. And uh, listen, I like the way the team's playing. I know we've seen a bunch of upsets so far in the tournament, but I think you got to ride Alabama in this one laying the points. Again, I think uh, laying what they are right now is very fair. I had Alabama a couple of points higher than Monday's current line. And when you look at what they've done, uh, besides the fact that you just can't go up against this team and expect to get multiple offensive rebounds and more than one look when a shot goes awry, it's a situation where they've got great chemistry at both ends of the floor, uh, both inside and out, and I think they'll be able to handle the Terrapins in this one. So we're going to recommend to play in Alabama, minus the points on a Monday. And again, star of the show for me, six-star play in college basketball on Monday. You can check that out on my homepage at DocSports.com. If you like the videos, click on that uh, thumbs up button. Be be sure to subscribe. I'm Scott Sprites of DocSports.com. Let's put Monday in the win column.